with Kun Som Chai, GM of the Key Resort and Kun Tanapong, Executive Director of Key Resort. Tell us how proud you are to be hosting the Miss Czech 2012 beauty contestants here in Phuket on the visit. Yeah, so we're proud to welcome them and also we are quite happy to have them in our hotel which we, they will um, publish and allow the world also because of Kun Kanapong, he is the one, a key man who consider that to take this party. Did the THE consult with you beforehand? Um, when, when did they talk about this? When did you start preparing? Yeah, they keep uh, discuss with us and also I uh, discuss with Kun Kanapong that we would like to get, take this party in, to our hotel and also he one consider to, to bring this I, I think you've done very well. Last mm -hmm. year, oh, yes. I, did, I had exclusive from the TAT mm -hmm. for the Polish beauty contestants. And they were at the Radisson, a long way from, what should we call, the centre of the island's entertainment. And this is a super hotel. I've not been here before, I'm very sorry. But I think it's wonderful, and I think it was a brilliant idea. Thank you. And you've brought them here. They're off to PP, so they're going to explore the island as well. Mm -hmm. But I think they'll be very happy here. So when did you first start sort of planning for it, for this visit? When did the pl pl planning start? Actually it's about three or four weeks ago. Yep. Quite recently? <laughs> wow. Quite, quite close, but then we try our best to prepare everything. <laughs> hey, you haven't been open that long, have you? When did you first open here, officially? Uh, we, opened, we opened last year. In November. November. November of 2011. Yeah. And so you started for the high season. Yeah. And now already in the peak, mm -hmm. peak week, if you like, yeah. or just after the peak week, you've now got some VIP guests. Yes. How many rooms do you have here? Uh, 244 rooms. 244 rooms. Yeah. 244 rooms. Yeah. And how is the occupancy now? Uh, we can say we are get. The best one is nearly 95% occupancy. Congratulations. Wow. Thank Congratulations. you. Congratulations. Yeah. Uh, actually, we opened in November 2010. 2010. 2010. Yeah. I thought it was a bit longer than that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So One just year. over a year. Okay. And how about the average then for this past year? How's it been? Did you have any l sort of low season last year? Um, for all year long, we got average occupancy around 85%. 85%. Yeah, 85%. So I think that's no long season in Phuket, especially right. in Kanong. Yeah. You're a very modern, very chic, stylish resort. What would you say is your style? Our style is modern. Modern style. Modern. In urban. Uh, would you say urban? Like a city hotel? Uh, Actually, our concept is. Uh, Contemporary Chino Portuguese. Contemporary? Yeah. Chinese Portuguese. Because, as you can see, we, we implement some Chino Portuguese, which is the Phuketian style inside the hotel as well. As you can see, uh, something like the table, chairs, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's quite Chinese. Yeah. Well, I'll let you get ready for the mischief. Uh, beauty contestants arriving soon. There's about a group of 30, isn't there, coming? A, a whole team. So I'm sure you're going to have a great week with them. And thanks for chatting to us before they arrive. Thank you. Okay. Hi now.
No. So. Ha. Contestants, what's your name? My name is Maria Batikova. Maria Batikova. You just yes. arrived at Key Resort with a coconut drink. <laughs> sure. How do you feel on arriving here? Oh, it's wonderful. It's such a nice welcome here. Really, I uh, I love the coconut drink. It's first time or second time here, but I'm bringing it, and it's just something special. But we don't have it at, at all in Czech Republic, and this is a really beautiful hotel we stay in. Have you ever been to Thailand before? No, 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 no. First, it's time. first time. First time. And in a beauty contest, is this the first time as well? No, and uh, this is like third or fourth uh, beauty contest I've been in, but nothing so big as like this, as this one. You haven't won before, then, yeah? No, so no. Maybe third or fourth time lucky, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> did you? Hopefully. Did you, did you go to other countries or? or? Yeah, uh, la actually in the uh, in the uh, autumn I visited uh, Dubai and yes. uh, and some uh, some Emirates, Oman too. And uh, before that, when I when I won one contest, I I went to uh, Turkey, Turkey to, for right. for a week to visit. Okay. Wow. So you enjoy your stay in Thailand. Uh, wonderful do you, time. Do you know what your schedule is during your stay here? Uh, this time it should be more uh, beachy and uh, kind of training program here. Plus, we're gonna for sure visit some safaris and uh, islands as a uh, as a uh, beach, PP island for sure, and uh, some other ones too. I hear you're also gonna visit a lady boy show. Do you know what that is? Oh, I do know. We visited once too. But Cabaret oh my show, god, yeah. I know, but I, I'm just so, so surprised. I have no idea that those boys are actually ladies. And like, oh, yes. I was so confused.
because on the beginning I really thought that they're just, just women. <laughs> well, you're staying here right in the middle of Patong, near where some of the ladyboys are on the, the street. You're right in the heart of the action, which we call the nightlife area. Are you happy about that? You, you like to be near the nightlife? I do, yeah, that's, that's really nice. I was just looking, well, anytime we are like passing by the streets, passing by those uh, different kind of stores and like cafeterias or whatever, it's just so lifeful. Like everywhere is so, something going on and you cannot even catch it, like what's, what's everywhere. It's happening. a busy place in it Baton, is, it's, yes. But it's wonderful, it's wonderful. Okay. It's also a very modern, chic, sort of stylish hotel. Right? I was just, Unusual for I this was area. honestly really surprised by that because as we are coming into the street, I, I wouldn't expect anything like this. And uh, honestly, I'm just amazed how they could create such a hotel like in this area. Like the streets are really kind of tiny, and how do they fit in here? Really? Uh, <laughs> must say your English is very good. Thank you. Is it is it part of the contest? You have to speak English. I gather one of the judges is Kevin Costner. Well, it was said, so I hope he will come. But uh, hard, hard to say. Who knows? So it would be really nice to meet him. Though. But uh, you know. As, uh, as a winner, you usually go to you, uh, you go to uh, Miss Universe contest. So it's really useful you, to speak English. You have to English. speak English, obviously, in the oh, Miss yeah. Universe contest, yeah, right? Yeah, it's really useful to do. Do you do you take part in the contest during this week? Is there any sort of competition during this week, or is it just girls, for shooting mean? among the girls? Do you oh, compete? Oh, girls, it's. Um, it's mostly pleasant time here. Like girls are really nice, and I honestly I didn't know them before, and we are getting uh, getting to know each other pretty well and becoming more and more friends. But you know, it's everywhere. Sometimes you go to those kind of topics, but I don't think we should that much talk about like who who do you think is gonna win and who do you think that uh, so doesn't belong there and these things. I just don't like it that much because when it's more like a holiday for me, when we are like ten of us together, just or you know, there is fourteen of us together, all of us. But this is such a big group of girls; it's really, really huge. So when when it's around, like uh, small groups and we just like quietly talk, it's just like more mellow and more nice. More all right. So you're a bit like a big family. A little um, bit, yeah. So we, can, we can sound it like that, and with, with all the cameramen. And <laughs> yes, you're gonna do a video like, shoots and photo yeah, shoots and as well. Yeah, and everyone, it's just like perfect. I presume you're all single. Is that right? Is that one of the rules? No, it's not. No, a rule. no really? No, you, you cannot be married, but you can be. You can have a boyfriend, of course. You can have boyfriends, right? Yeah, yeah. So, but are they allowed to come on the trip as well? No, they're no. not. No, 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 no. I don't think that would be a good idea for girls. That would be too much distraction, you know. Yeah. Well. Yes, but I guess yes. You'll get lots of a, a, a admiring ma men watching you during this trip. Do you worry about sort of the attention you get? A bit like well, sort of film stars, and <laughs> superstars. It hasn't been like that yet, but <laughs> honestly, uh, it's it's nice when they are watching. When there's nothing more happening, it's just like that you know that they, uh, that they are interested, that something is happening. So it's like nice to like walk through the path of kind of. Some, some, something like a fame. Right. <laughs> anyway, fame. whatever you win or lose, would you come back again as maybe with your boyfriend? Oh my god, of course. <laughs> I was just talking about it yesterday with my parents even, because my parents love to travel. So we were thinking that this is our next trip, because like two years so ago we were in South Africa. Ground, South Africa, so yeah. I, exactly, I'm just checking it out now here and next time I think I'm, I might be the driver's pilot to show him like where to go and we're gonna visit that and go to see like yeah. some some alligators, for example, we are sitting on a crocodile, I couldn't believe that, that was right. wonderful. <laughs> you going to go elephant trekking as well, do you think? Oh, I think so, yeah. Sure, so, yeah. yeah, we should, yeah, we should. We should. Alright, well, we'll let you enjoy your coconut drink you and settle in, and many oh, thank thanks you. for talking to us. Me so, too, well. thank you, thank you very much. much. <laughs> Thank you very much.